Hi, my name is Rachel. I am a farming wife and I wanted to show you really quick some things that we use on our farm during harvest that have made things just run so much more smoothly and they're just really handy to have around. You can get almost all of these things on Amazon and I cannot express to you how wonderful they've made our life um, since everything's really crazy during that time anyway. Um, these things just really help. So starting off, Headsets are wonderful. These are noise canceling. These are, they're not cheap, but they're a cheaper version and you just hook it onto your ear. I have really small ears and so it's always hard for me to find something that, um, you know, fits in there, <laughs> but uh, you don't have to have any app for these. You just hook up the Bluetooth in your phone. We love them so much. I got one for my parents <laughs> so my mom can still like do stuff while she's talking to me. Um, even for that reason, these are just wonderful to have around, especially if you do have kids um, and you, you need to have your hands free, but it's an important phone call. This is where it's at. These are wonderful. I highly recommend these. I've been very happy with them. Um, my husband did buy a more expensive version, but came back to this little guy. So my family is really into camping and we had um, like way cheaper versions, <laughs> but I'm going to not point towards the camera. There's a few different ones. Anyway, my husband used to think I was ridiculous when we would um, go out during calving season in the middle of the night and we're checking all the calves and um, he's I was like we need one of these hand headlamps he's like that's ridiculous we don't need one of these well this last year he caved and got one of these and he actually was using it in the shop this morning um, getting you know working under trucks and needing to see up up there um, this is wonderful I know there's a lot going on here. It Honestly, it looks like it would be pretty heavy, but it's not. You don't feel hardly anything. I think if you go ahead and get one of these, you'll use it more than you think you will. Um, they are wonderful, super bright. Okay, so this looks kind of silly, but I'm really excited about it. So I got a miniature refrigerator when our daughter was born, and honestly, this was just to put milk in um, when she's done eating, and then I don't have to drag around the coolers and stuff like that. Um, sometimes we keep this in our car. Um, it comes with a regular plug-in so you can use it in the house. You can also use it in the vehicle, in the tractor, anywhere you want. The shelf in here is removable. But it was very affordable. We've been really happy with it. Of course it can't completely replace um, a, fr a refrigerator but it is it's a good way to go. The best thing about this is it has a switch here on the back so you can set it to cool or you can switch it to warm up whatever's in there. So the advertisement on the box showed a sandwich. Um, you can have it, keep it nice and cold and then kind of warm it up. But um, this is one of those things that I bought for me and I was like, this is gonna end up in the tractor. So I went ahead and got pink for kicks and giggles because I'm sure it will get a lot of use on the farm but um, I'm really excited about this. I know a lot of tractors these days come with little refrigerators in the cab, but um, not many people have money for that. Brown gloves. So I use these year round actually, and I have little hands, <laughs> and it's hard for me to find gloves at the farm stores because normally they don't carry those smaller sizes. Um, so you can buy these in bulk on Amazon. They're great for my gloves. I usually just take some craft paint and I put a little dot um, actually just right here um, below the thumb area so that I can quickly and easily tell who's or who's and that works really well. Pet cameras or security cameras. We have two different ones. Um, this is just a pet camera but they have made things run so much faster. Um, this pet cam actually has a screen. It's at my in-laws house, unfortunately, so I can't show that, but everything will be in the description below this video that you can go check it out. And these have their own cameras. Um, everybody keeps, uh, we have two semis and there are two cameras. Unfortunately, there's only one screen per camera, but uh, we keep a screen in the, each semi and then we set up two cameras right next to each other. Um, they do have to be plugged in, but it's not like we don't have a bunch of extension cords laying around, so we put them to use. This way, you can line up your semi under the auger and um, you know not have to get out as much. Sometimes they'll get out and check stuff, but um, these 
have been wonderful week. I have pretty bad allergies and so I go through a lot of dust masks during harvest. I switch them out um, once a week, sometimes more. And this one has a little filter um, so that if you're wearing glasses, when you breathe out, this little yellow piece will kind of uh, push forward and it will prevent your glasses from fogging up. I wear sunglasses all the time, so that's wonderful. My dad got me started on those and um, he wears regular glasses. The rest of the family wears these, um, but it's a very, very good quality mask. My helper is getting a little impatient here, but um, again, I have really bad allergies. So Claritin or Zyrtex, um, that as well as Flonies has been a total lifesaver. I also use um, just, I've learned to go ahead and just use it every single day if I'm out on the farm, whether I think I need it or not, but a nasal spray. Um, it's just basically like a salt water solution, but it is different than salt water, so do not make your own. But um, just kind of spray, you, you honestly, you just like spray it up your nose and then um, grab a clean extra quick and then blow your nose and it'll all come out, especially when it's dry, the weather is really dry, um, that actually helps. Um, you know keep moisture up up in your nose so those are very good things as well oh you want to show the hat this is the hat that grandma got JJ isn't isn't that fun yeah he's he's very proud of it he never wore hats until until grandma got him that he really loves it so anyway again all of these will be linked in the description box below this video have a safe and wonderful harvest